Good evening. As chairman of the Spread the Word Nevada Board of Directors and the chief accounting officer of the Finley Automotive Group, <clears throat> it is my great privilege to welcome you to our amazing 21st annual Storybook Gala benefiting this important and worthwhile cause, helping children in need experience the joy and power of reading. Thank you for being with us here tonight. Thank you. I am thrilled to be standing on this stage, looking out at an audience full of communities, most generous and kind-hearted people. There are a few folks in the room who have shown exceptional generosity in support of this event, and I'd like to recognize their incredible contributions. First, a massive thank you to our presenting sponsors, Finley Honda in Centennial Hills, Finley Honda Henderson, and Finley Toyota. <clears throat> Your support over the years has made a tangible and remarkable difference in the lives of thousands of children. Our community is a brighter place because you are in it. A special thank you as well to our premier sponsors, the Bennett Family Foundation, Imbrefex Books, Majestic Realty, and Judge, Judge Gregory Gordon, Judge Regina McConnell, and Judge Stacy Rochelle for joining us this evening. Thank you for your commitment to advancing childhood literacy and last and lastly, to the Aria Resort and Casino. The partnership and hospitality you have shown spread the word in support of this gala is unmatched, and we are so grateful for your entire team. I'd also like to take a moment and ask our Spread the Word Nevada board members to please stand and be recognized for their commitment and dedication to the success of this great organization. Please join me in giving them a hand. Thank you all. <clears throat> and finally, I'd like to thank each and every one of you here tonight. Your presence in this room is actively helping us rewrite the story of education in Nevada. It is no secret that our state isn't exactly the poster child for educational excellence. Only 27% of Nevada's young adults or young students can read proficiently meaning that roughly two out of three children are struggling to develop the skills they need to be successful in life. This statistic is staggering and something we can't ignore. We know, though, that reading is the great equalizer. In fact, the number of age-appropriate books in a child's home is a bigger predictor of academic and professional success than both the parent's highest educational level and a parent's income. Books are powerful tools, and with your help tonight, we can equip the next generation of readers and leaders with the skills they need to change the trajectory of their lives and change the world. So let's make this evening count. Let's dig deep, open our hearts, and pledge to do whatever it takes to ensure that every child in our community has the opportunity to earn their spot in the history books. Thank you. It is now my distinct pleasure to introduce Lisa Habighorst, CEO and co-founder, as well as Laurie Hardig, the founder of Spread the Word Nevada. Please give them a round of applause. Wow, it's hard to believe what a gorgeous evening, and we're so thrilled that you're here with us. Welcome, everyone, to Spread the Word Nevada's 21st Annual Storybook Gala, presented by Friendly Honda and Friendly Toyota. Tonight, we gather in spirit of celebration, community, and most importantly, in support of shared mission to ignite the light, the love of reading, 
in the hearts of Nevada's children in need. As we stand before you tonight, we're filled with gratitude and excitement. Gratitude for each and every one of you who has generously contributed your time, your resources, and your unwavering support to our cause. And excitement, because together we have achieved remarkable milestones during this past year. It's hard to believe that what started out as a humble vision from our hearts has blossomed into Nevada's largest childhood literacy nonprofit organization. Thank you. <laughs> a, a dream come true. We'd have dis we distribute over 70,000 free books a month to 78 schools throughout the state of Nevada. And tonight, we reflect on our journey. We're truly amazed by the incredible growth and the impact that we have witnessed. And I'm going to take a special just moment to thank Lisa Habakors. She is the vision, the heart, the soul, and the dedication that has brought us to where we are and who has made all this happen. Didn't need to do that. Okay, I'll start crying early. That's good. You all, anybody who's been here before knows I cry, usually by the end, but maybe earlier tonight. Um, we need to realize, and we know our work is far from over. There are still so many children who need us, and we can't wait to get to them. As we come together this evening to raise funds for our programs, we have the opportunity to make an even greater impact on the lives of Nevada students, an impact that extends far beyond giving out one or two books. Together, we ensure that every child in our community has the opportunity to discover the magic of reading unlocking a bright and prosperous future. So let tonight be a celebration of our collective achievements, a testament to the power of literacy, and a reminder of the impact we can have when we come together as a community. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey, and here's to an unforgettable evening filled with laughter, inspiration, and most importantly, a really awesome dessert that's about to knock your socks off. But first, please enjoy your dinner prepared by Aria's incredible chefs, and we'll be back in a bit with more exciting things to come. <laughs> 